star stuff. <laughs> Need the guy that I know. That's a good swing, and Chris Marrero has his first major league hit. Hitting that ball extremely hard into left field. That'll be two on, two out for Wilson Ramos. And Miguel Cairo will hand the ball to Bo Porter, who will put it into the dugout. Mom's happy, the family's happy. And uh, Evidently a one man wave that didn't last too long. <laughs> uh, congratulations, Chris Marrero. It's a moment you'll remember the rest of your life. That ball's going on your mantle, in your office. Your first big league hit. How about that? Well, let's see if it. And that's how most of these guys are wired. Oh, what great elevation by Marrero on a grab. Chris Morrell says Ian Desmond you can go upstairs so can I to the ninth and that's down by three and Kimbrough coming. That'll be a ground ball that Morrell will get an RBI on. That's okay. It's the first out of the inning now you've got another man at third base. Great at bats what you're supposed to do in that situation. A little 14 inch number nine coming in this AB. Morrell cracks one to center. That ties the game. One hops the wall. He motors to second. And the rookie has done it again. And the Nats have made Bud Norris pay for both of his walks tonight. And this one had an error along with it. What a great at bat by Chris Marrero. Cashing in on a mistake. Fouling off a couple of pitches. Hanging in there tough. He gets a 3 2 pitch. Right out over the middle, 95 mile an hour fastball. We talk about getting the barrel to the baseball. That was a good swing. A double for Marrero. An RBI, and this thing's all tied up. And partner, the beginning of the inning. And Marrero up the middle with a base hit. Zimmerman scores. Here comes Michael Morse. The Nets are on the board. And Chris Marrero doubles his career RBI total. And two out RBIs are backbreakers. This is a ball game. A nice piece of hitting right there. You see the curveball? Didn't try to pull it. Let it get deep right back up the middle. Don't try to do too much with it. Back to back nights. Chris Marrero with some big hits for the Nats. Well, I asked Randy Knorr about Marrero yesterday around the cage as well as Lombardozzi. He said the thing about these two kids is they both know how to hit, they're up there with an idea. And they're not just up there hacking. And that was a wonderful example. Cincinnati. That ball's well hit to right. Heading for the track. Worth will score easily. Over to third, Espinoza. A very productive out that ties the game. And Marrero's fifth career run batted in. How about Chris Marrero's approach with runners in scoring position in the last three or four games? A couple of clutch hits in his homestand. A good approach, thinking about using the whole field, gets a hanging slider. Marrero going the other way. That ball's flirting with the chalk line over there. And it's fair. Scoring is Espinoza. And the ball bounces out, or Marrero might have had a triple. So the Nats lead 4 0 on a ball that was in the air for a while and never did go slicing foul. You remember the last game in New York, Chris Marrero hit five balls right on the screws, had nothing to show for it, an 0 for 4 day. He got the ground ball in the hole the other night, and he said, FP, I was thinking of you because I got myself a cheap hit. Well, guess what? You got yourself another one right there because that ball had some serious hang time, and Mike Stanton wanted nothing to do with it. So now Marrero's got a double, an RB. And Marrero rips it up the middle. Jason Worth will score. Nats are on the board. And Chris Marrero with his 10th big league RBI. How about that when the count had gone to 0 2? Good fight, good battle, big hits. 1 0 Nats. And you know what? Chris Marrero's days of riding buses in the minor leagues are over, for me at least. He's a big leaguer, and he will be a big leaguer next year. He keeps getting big hits. He's great with runners in scoring position. His defense has been spectacular at first after a shaky start in game one in Cincinnati. He'll drive in a run with a bouncer to the right side that'll move both runners forward. 
And the Nationals are on the board. Chris Marrero's first RBI this year, the 11th of his career. Productive out. Yeah, get him over, get him in. You know, not the ideal out in this situation, but a good at-bat for Marrero. First run across for the Nats today. Moves